Hey, welcome back to another video from Game Drop. And today's video is very exciting, especially to myself. I might be a little biased because Demon Slayer is in fact my favorite anime of all time. And the Demon Slayer movie, I think is the best movie I've seen in the past year or two. Um, but this game, Demon Slayer Kimetsu no Yeba, the Hinokami Chronicles, will be releasing October 13th of this year, of 2021. It's gonna be releasing to PS4, PS5, Xbox One, and Xbox Series X. Now the game's gonna be $60, which is a little steep, but I don't have a problem paying every penny of that. Um, I expect the game to really, you know, be endless fun, especially with the PvP, the fighting. Um, there's going to be several characters that you can play with, literally anyone from the anime from what I've seen so far. So you'll be fighting as Inosuke, you'll be fighting as Zenitsu, Nezuko, you'll be fighting as Rengoku. You know, it's going to be absolutely sick. You know, they each have their own moves, as you guys know who've seen the anime. So to be able to go through all of their focus forms and use all their moves, it's going to be absolutely insane. There you see Tanjiro finding the thread. You know, the anime was so damn good if you guys haven't seen it. And what's even cooler is for those of you who have seen it, we can pretty much relive it while playing as Tanjiro, you know, in his point of view. So it's sick. It's like we get to relive the entire 26 episode series again. And like I mentioned, there is going to be PvP, which I think could be extremely fun. I haven't gotten into a fighting game in quite some time, but I will make sure I get good at this. Imagine being able to use Zenitsu and being able to use, you know, his 10 thunder breathing ta techniques. You know what I mean? How cool is that? There's so many moves that we don't even know that they have that we'll get to explore and learn more about the characters in this game. Because we haven't got to see every single one of Zenitsu's moves or Inosuke's. But yeah, I mean, there's so many things that we could learn from this game that we haven't even yet been exposed to in the anime. And I believe the second season comes out right around the same time as this game. So the whole Demon Slayer is just going to pop off around Halloween time. And I'm sure most of you guys, if you're watching this video, you have seen this series. And I mean, just imagine we get to fight Rui and his spider family or Susamaru with the, all those crazy balls that she was throwing through the house. You know, these are fights that we're going to be able to relive. And it's probably been a while since you've seen that episode. So it's going to be dope. It's going to be nostalgic. We'll get to fight Drum Demon, dude. It's going to be awesome. And for you guys who have not seen the anime series, please watch it. In a nutshell, it's about a, a boy named Tanjiro who comes home and finds his entire family slaughtered by demons. His only, the only survivor somewhat is his sister Nezuko, but she was turned into a demon. Um, and the entire series is Nezuko uh, and Tanjiro trying to figure out how we can turn her back into a human. And they get in some crazy fights against some crazy demons. The character development in this series is as good as anything I've ever watched, anime or not. It's just so damn good. And then the fighting scenes, you know, and Tanjiro is such a badass. There's so many life lessons you can learn from this little dude, deadass. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Again, it comes out in October. Make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe for more gaming news. I'm out. Peace.